Alrighty, so this is the FTX-1 series. And the reason we're saying the series and calling it the series is because it really is not just a radio. It is a series of radios on there. This model that we have here, a lot of people have been seeing obviously the FTX-1, but this is the FTX-1 in the Optima version. So what is the Optima version? Well, it is the FTX-1 here with the SPA-1 as a package deal. So it's not just, when you buy the Optima, it's not just, hey, I'm just getting the amp or something. You're getting the whole complete radio set with it on there. Now, we built this with a concept of, as someone said yesterday, and I don't even know if it's a real word, modularity. So it, so it sounds like a cool word. If we're, It's gonna be our new buzzword. Uh, but what it is, is basically, it's like you're at home. You wanna do 100 watts through um, HF and six meters. But now, or 50 watts on VHF and UHF. Now what I wanna do is I wanna go out somewhere. I wanna take it with me to go camping, whatever, whatever you do. You simply push the button on the top here and then it's gonna go ahead and disconnect. That simple and that easy on there. Now, a lot of people have had questions about the connections. The connections, yes, are built into on there. And then you have, in essence, technically, if you count both antenna ports, you have five antenna connect, or five connections you need to do on the radio. Um, we suggest always powering it off. But what you're gonna do is you're gonna pull this part out here and then that is the antenna connections for the uh, HF and then as well as VHF. Next, you're gonna go ahead and unplug the speaker connection on there. You're gonna unplug the 13.8 volt DC and then you're gonna unplug the actual tuner amplifier connection cable on there. Now, this is the radio, this is good to go. What you can do then is, is you can either connect it with 13.8 volts DC or as you see on the back here, there's the modularity concept. You can attach the battery to it. You can actually attach the FC80 antenna tuner over the battery with it too. So it allows you all that functionality in there. Now, when on battery, it does only do six watts. When you connect in the 13.8 volt DC, you're gonna be able to do 10 watts. But as you see here, very simple, easy. I mean, it's it's kind of like the old, old like military style, you know, hey, yeah. be, I'll call it in there, you know. Yeah. Uh, but it does have a whole list of features on there too. This is the actual GPS chip. That is, is that available now? It, it is, if it's not available now, I know they're shipping. Um, okay. We have a lot coming in right now. Yeah. That's where there's been a lot of confusion of people saying, well, how soon is the Optima? How soon is the SPA-1? We have um, them coming in right now. It's just a matter of getting them in and then getting them to the dealers, pre-orders, however they have it set up. We don't know that with the dealers on there. 